Okay, so today we're gonna learn how to cut a waffle. On my fork, I have a little sticker here, and that's to symbolize where I'm supposed to put my pointer finger. So when I hold my nut fork, I'm gonna put my finger down here, and it's kinda gonna turn upside down for when I stab it. In my other hand, in my right hand, I have a knife, and the knife has two parts to it. The knife has a top part, which is flat, and the knife has a bottom part. The bottom part has these little teeth on it, and that makes uh, it for cutting. So I want my finger to go by the top part. I have this little sticker here, and my finger with a Band-Aid is gonna go uh, on top of the sticker. So now we're ready to cut. Now that we have our fingers in the right places, turn the, nut, the fork upside down, and the first thing we're gonna do is stab. So stab it, and then with our knife and our fingers in the right places, we're gonna go back and forth like a saw and cut. Great job, we cut it in half. So next we have to turn our food. I don't wanna use my hands because my hands might have germs or are dirty. So with the fork and the knife, I can turn my food and then I have to stab it again. So stab and then cut back and forth. Stab and cut back and forth. Stab, cut back and forth and stab the back and forth. I want all my pieces to be about this size, okay? I want them to be what's called bite size, small. And then I'm gonna go to the other side, stab and cut back and forth, stab and cut back and forth, stab and cut back and forth. Okay, sometimes when I finish cutting, I see some pieces that are a little too big so I'm gonna go back to those pieces and cut them to be nice and small. And now I've managed to cut all my food. I didn't touch it with my hands and it looks really neat and ready to eat. Great job.